The governor's FY19 budget proposal seeks the authorization to spend $1.4 billion in one option and over $930 million in its second option. The first option would require raising the business privilege tax. Here's more. The governor's budget request for fiscal year 2019 operations has two options. The first of which asks for the authorization to spend $1,040,948,857. The second option seeks the authorization to spend $930,852,312. These figures include general fund, special fund, and federal matching fund revenues. According to the budget cover letter, the administration is anticipating a loss of $66.1 million in revenues for FY 2019 because of the Trump tax cuts. So, in light of this, option one of the budget seeks to raise the business privilege tax, also known as the gross receipts tax, by 2%. The governor writes that this would, quote, return our revenue collections to what we had initially anticipated in the fiscal 2018 budget and maintain that level for fiscal 2019. It would also allow us to ensure that the health and well-being of our island is finally addressed by providing a stable and continuous funding source for the Guam Memorial Hospital. Without raising taxes, the governor says in his budget letter that, quote, we will have to cut into all government branches and agencies, finding ways to insulate those agencies that provide core services, including public safety, public health, and education, and will have effectively kicked the can down the road by abandoning our only public hospital, end quote. 